What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overlord here. So we're talking about the Chucky TV series again in this video. So today Deadline brought out a a uh, a report uh, to confirm that Tiffany Valentine will once again be portrayed by Jennifer Tilly who is confirmed to now be returning for the upcoming second season and they did go ahead and confirm that the the series is still slated to come out this fall in 2022. I also want to add that as of this uh, video that I'm recording right now from what I have gathered the series itself second season is still expected to film late april around april 20th i believe um out in canada and then of course they will be they'll be going through the post-production then we'll get the series premiere second season premiere in october hopefully again to line up with what they did last last time with season one so now that we know that tiffany will be back this again confirms that maybe we'll get to see some new storylines of course involving her i know a lot of you were hoping that she's back as a as a main lead character this time around and in a lot more episodes i think that we'll see more of the tiffany doll this time around honestly uh, i would like to see more of her interacting with nika since nika has no body parts and i know a lot of you are still hoping that they somehow correct that and I like that they also have already told us that 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 just because Nika doesn't have any limbs, she's not done. So I think Nika will get a new body or something will happen, hopefully, where Nika finds out that this is not something that's real and her limbs are still there. But you never know. You never know. I just think Nika at this point is going to hop into another body. I think that's what's going to happen. Um, so, yeah, the, the series itself is still expected to premiere later this fall on the USA and Sci-Fi Network. And we already got a tweet from from the official Chucky Twitter account saying that we're not prepared for what what he has in store for us later this fall, uh, calling us jerks along with it. You know, typical Chucky stuff. So whoever runs that runs that account does a great job capturing that character and, it, and their attitude. <laughs> So we'll see what they have in store for us later this year. Don Mancini, I believe, also gave out a comment stating that we're thrilled to start pulling the strings on a second season of Puppet Mayhem with Chucky. Um, many thanks to our partners at USA Sci-Fi for their incredible support and guidance, bringing Chucky to the small screen bigger than ever and to the fans. Chucky sends his still undying thanks and a message. This isn't over, not by a long shot. You better watch your backs in 2022. Now, I know a lot of you are also hoping that you see more of Lexi, see more of Devin, see more of Jake and see how their little trio that they have going on is thriving now. I don't know what time period this will be set in. I imagine this will pick up maybe shortly after the finale, maybe even a couple months after. My hope is that it picks up with us in that truck with Andy and the Tiffany doll so we can see what happens there. Because ultimately, if it doesn't pick up there, then I think that means that we'll not have any answers to what happened there until later on in hopefully the season premiere or later on in a earlier episode and not a season finale. Because I just hope that there's this this there, i hope there's a mentality that goes along with wanting to address certain things up front before jumping into new stuff because i don't want to see new storylines brought up while we're continuing to leave question marks around other things and then while you're building new questions up you have old questions that haven't been answered then that makes it a little bit more difficult to address a, a lot of stuff because you're basically cornering yourself into a place where you'd have to address it in one giant episode when you could be providing answers in one episode a week uh give give a little bit here give a little bit there just to let everything breathe just to not put yourself into a corner and not end up in a position like where pretty little liars ended up <laughs> um but hopefully with chucky season two we see a lot of other returning characters i know mike norris is someone a lot of people want to see back uh we want to see andy's mom karen barkley back uh so hopefully we get to see them back and i know dom has has already talked about the idea of having some old familiar faces we know that the actress who played the silva in chucky child's play 3 i meant to say has already expressed interest that she would love to be involved in the in the series if asked so maybe we see her back i don't know what they could pull i just know that this fall if it ends up sticking with its release date if nothing happens we are in store for some more bloody goodness of course because chucky season one was far better better than i know a lot of people were also expecting it did surpass expectations with a lot of people and the way that they were able to give you a narrative regarding chucky and his origins and not make it overly sympathetic and just making it more along the lines of something similar to michael myers you kind of just became even more disturbed by the character there isn't really anything that set him off he kind of just was always like this there's something wrong with him I hope that they try to address something in regards to what it might be and just give us a lot of things along the way for us to speculate as to what it might be that 
that is wrong with the with Charles because there's nothing that was presented to us that seemed to cause him to do that. He was just always a troubled young boy that just went off the deep end when it came to his disdain for humanity. So maybe there'll be other things that we find out along the way that help us kind of speculate as to what went wrong with him. We don't need to get a clear cut answer. I think leaving a lot of discussion around it would make him even i think that would just propel chucky even further and have him constantly being talked about even when the franchise is no longer being or pushing out new content i think that would always just be keeping that character alive and keeping him thriving when you have lack of answers but a lot of stuff that could give you certain conclusions to draw that still are satisfying in the end but not necessarily saying yes that's it maybe there's multiple different answers that could be correct without the series directly directly telling you no it's this definitive answer and in regards to why charles is the way that he is because he was just portrayed as some sick child troubled child who just went off the deep end and now we know how he ended up how he is and we saw his relations with other characters like eddie caputo come to play so who knows what could happen in the second season of chucky i know also people are hoping they could get an answer about kyle uh if kyle's alive again i'll be happy but i also will be kind of wondering okay well why did you have such a dramatic scene if no one really got hurt <laughs> and i don't think that's something they should do out of habit either like just messing with you as a viewer you know if you're gonna kill someone just kill them commit to it go through it and go back stronger on the end as you progress forward <laughs> but we'll see what happens and we'll see how tiffany and her return will factor into the narrative i do think we'll see a lot more of the tiffany doll this time around so just something about what happened with andy and the doll at the end feels like it's going to be a major factor in where things go since we know that the ultimate plan was for chucky to take over america i think with those dolls getting them sent out places but let me know what you guys think about all this down in the comment section below what else would you like to see from chucky season two would you like to see other people return like from bride of chucky even or maybe some characters from c to chucky uh let me know all that down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you go ahead and subscribe turn on post notification you never miss a video in the description i link to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video